Just a few weeks from now, you're going to notice a new AMR car on the roads, but it won't have a paramedic inside. Instead, there will be a doctor driving on their way to an emergency to provide care on the spot. Two on your side's Danielle Church shows us why two organizations partnered up for the Mobile Emergency Physician Response Program. A picture's worth a thousand words. Exactly why UBMD physicians are working with AMR to soon get five of these emergency response vehicles on the road. If we can get there and lay our eyes on the actual scenes themselves and be able to help analyze and then decide about patient care on the spot, that's beneficial to ultimately the patient. To the patient and to the emergency rooms who are already swamped. UBMD physicians or EMS fellows will now be able to provide a helping hand in any high severity 911 call or mass casualty situation. The definition of mass casualty is that you've run out of resources. Um, if there's a, in, a, in a perfect world, we have an unlimited amount of ambulances and firefighters and EMTs that are present. Um, the reality is that many times in a mass casualty situation, we simply run out of those. With this new program, AMR paramedics will get help from the physicians about who should get sent to the ER first and treat patients on scene instead of sending them to the hospital. The physicians will also have additional tools in their cars, including cardiac life support, basic life support, communications gear, and refrigerators for medications. Unfortunately, some events happen that we can't have control over. Um, what we need to talk about is how can we better partner ourselves uh, for the preparedness when it comes to those types of environments and those scenes. You'll see these cars at scenes in a few weeks. Until then, physicians will undergo training on the program. Danielle Church, Channel 2 News.